We begin with an update on breaking news that we first brought you earlier this evening. Neighbors who live close to where a person was shot by police after a traffic stop are describing what they saw tonight. I heard the guy saying, help me, help me. I didn't do anything. And then he said that about five times and then he, and I heard the gunshot. According to Huntsville Police, an officer opened fire after the driver assaulted the officer. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Naja Sherman. Dan Schaefer has the evening off. Well, let's get right to Way 31's Cody Fisher. He's live on Wilkinson Drive where it all happened. Been following this story all day. So, Cody, what have you learned since we last spoke? Naja, about two hours ago, a tow truck came and took out a red car from the driveway of the house where this shooting happened on Wilkinson Drive. Now, I emailed police to find out how that car is related, but I have not gotten a response yet. I did speak with a neighbor, though, to, and they were at home when this shooting happened. Robbie Cartwright says she was in her house today when she heard screaming from outside, so she went to check it out. I saw the police going up in the yard. With his gun drawn, and I heard the guy was screaming, Help me, help me, I didn't do anything. She heard that five times before. And I heard the gunshot. Cartwright did not see exactly what happened from where she was standing, but she saw what happened next. I saw them bring him out, and the ambulance drove away with him. According to police, the driver was pulled over for a traffic stop. They pulled into Wilkinson Drive. Sometime during the stop, there was an altercation. Police told Way 31 the driver assaulted the officer who pulled their gun and fired. Cartwright says she's used to seeing police in the neighborhood. The police is out here all the time because there's something going on all the time, but typically we, we feel safe, you know, but it's always something going on. But this is different. That's the first time I ever experienced something like that. Now, right now, we still don't know the condition of the driver who was taken to the hospital, but police told us that he, they were alive when they were put into the ambulance. Reporting live in Huntsville, Cody Fisher, Way 31 News.